Time for this morning's Health Watch, and this morning we're looking at heart-healthy foods, and all of them are red. Our Dr. Jennifer Ashton is here to explain why color counts. Good morning, Good doctor. morning, Maggie. Makes sense. We always hear the brighter the food, the more nutritious. That's right. But specifically these red foods, what is it about tomatoes that's good for well, your you heart? Well, you want to eat the colors of the rainbow, and we do have to remember we're talking here about natural ways to be good to our heart. We're not talking about substituting these foods for medication that your doctor may have put you on. But specifically okay. when you talk about tomatoes, Mediterranean diet's very high in tomatoes. We know that they're good. They're good because they contain an antioxidant known as lycopene, which the thinking is may help to reduce your bad cholesterol or LDL cholesterol. Okay, let's move to beets. This is going to take some convincing. Convince <laughs> you don't like me them? to like beets. No. Oh, they're so good. A little, um, little onion, a little balsamic vinegar maybe. Beets are very high in fiber, so they're a low-calorie food. They fill you up. They also possibly can have a beneficial effect on your blood pressure by stabilizing the, the walls of the arteries. So again, you do have to remember when you eat beets, mm -hmm. you will see them in the toilet the next okay, day. Okay, so don't, don't be think, alarmed. Do not think you're bleeding to death internally, but they're very good for us. <laughs> good tip. All right, red peppers. Okay, so chilies contain C for something called chilies. capsaicin. Exactly. And capsaicin also works potentially on lowering the bad cholesterol. It also may have an effect on thinning your blood, so it prevents some type of clotting. And again, spicy things, potentially good for you. And They make you sweat. Is that good for you, too? A little bit. That can't hurt. Yeah, no, not All right. Much. Beans seems obvious because they're high in fiber, which exactly. is such an important part so of the So specifically, diet. red kidney beans, very high in fiber, high protein, low calorie, not just red kidney beans, but all types of beans, never a bad thing to add to your diet. And pomegranates, they have ev pomegranates in everything lately. It's the, the new fad. That's right. This is the superfood. P for polyphenols. They contain a big class of antioxidants that really prevent the oxidative damage, so the stress on our cells. And this is a very high polyphenol antioxidant food. Just a word of caution, this can interact with some medications, mm. so you do want to check with your doctor, particularly if you're on a statin medication. But pomegranates are good. All right, I do like pomegranates. Good. Thank you, Jen. And speaking of red, more than 20 celebrities are teaming up tonight to show off the red dress collection to help raise heart health awareness. This is all part of Heart Truth Fashion Show, and you can see it tonight at 7 Eastern on earlyshow.cbsnews.com.